Ah, hello there, you wonderful people. Welcome to the map that is Crossroads. Uh, we have a lot of shooting going out outside here in real life. I'm recording this here on, uh, well, New Year's. New Year's Eve, I think it is, or afternoon. <laughs> so, uh, apologies if you hear any fireworks going off in the background. It's not coming from the game sound. Hmm. Anyway, we have... Elpern in the red, playing as the Soviets and ooh counterattack tactics. <laughs> yes, with the B4 and the KV1 and shock troops, recon and for the mother Russia, they get plus twenty five percent armor. All right, infantry, right? MGs more accuracy too. Okay, and his opponent is Clausewitz, playing as the Austere, who is bringing along Spearhead, Jaeger, and Storm Doctrine. Yes. Uh, bullets and twice, let's see. Clausewitz here, more accuracy for the Grins. They also fire a bit faster. And then, of course, the Closed Fist. See, it's, it's closed, but this one here is not to be used on Panzers. It hurts. Ow. Um, Elper, more accuracy for the conscripts. This gun production is much faster, and the this gun mm, have increased armor penetration. And for some reason, they are not using the the cis gun in the picture here. They're using the uh, the little the little AT gun instead. The baby AT gun. Always found that weird. And I wonder if this bulletin here actually affects the little baby H gun. First engagement happening there and also over here. Oh my. Clausewitz really predicted that Elpen would take advantage of this bit of green cover here, which there is no equivalent of over here on the other side. Uh, well, heavy machine gun there is just going to take pop shots. Softening up the squad a bit. And now the pioneers may be able to get in there. Oh, and now he's got to sit down. Getting in closer to do a close up shot. Not killing the gunner here, allowing him to squish that trigger furthermore. There is also these guys here not moving in yet. Has yet to kill a model on all of these conscripts. And this guy, he's next to die, I'd guess. There we go. Fi oh. Actually shot the guy behind him. And thus, <laughs> Elpern, with the power of imbalanced map design, won that engagement. But he is being, being kicked out over here. But then, okay. To be fair, Clausewitz moving in there with the heavy machine gun may have been a tad greedy. Just a little bit. He thought he was in the clear, but nope. Elpern, he just walked back into that green cover and slapped the uh, slapped the bullets out of the heavy machine gun. All right then. Elpern also denying some denying some green cover here. <clears throat> we have the point. Oh, you do, but it's not in supply. It is not in supply. Man, these men, they are so low. Support weapons company here. Up and running. Yeah, Elpern, he has gotten his initial build slash opening down. So I'd say Clausewitz has. Oh, wait, what? Clausewitz actually going for the uh, flamethrower on the pioneers here. Hmm. Not hitting there with the flamethrower, surprisingly. Uh, does he want one more burst here? No. But he wants to keep the Pioneer Squad on the field so he can cap these points without bringing f 
much infantry over but then again he may have to as Elpern he's gonna hug the screen cover and yeah if he flanks from down here then he'll just yep walk over to that wall <sighs> oh looks like Dimitri he is out of cover heavy cover here so there's potential for some yes potential for some uh, suppression there Not much is over here guarding this area. Ilpern is sitting out conscripts and notice the lack of sandbags here. It grins. Oh, he is. Yeah, he tried to get down a sandbag, but Claw Svitz has already set his claws inside of this territory. And Ilpern is just falling on back. Back to better cover. And Klausvitz is like, all right then, I'm not going to challenge those conscripts. Instead, heading to the middle where Ilpern, you know, also is with a couple of his conscripts. Good wiring here by Ilpern, denying the sandbags to be used by Klausvitz, who is retreating that squad. I suppose there is a very important um, department meeting since everybody is gathered here. Oh, okay. Maybe they're just here to see the, the new medic station. A uh, very late, like a mechanized company here by Claus Fitz. But then again, this one here also seems a bit late. A bit late. Molotov package. All right. Grenades have been unlocked for Elpern. Yes, it is Elpern playing under this weird alias. Tickle, tickle. Where's it going? Oh, there we go. Quad mount. And mow down the enemy, they will. Klauswitz. Not gonna be a 2 to 2 He's going for the pack gun. Doesn't say build town here. If he had this bulletin here, it would have been on the field a lot quicker. And now the 2-2-2 two, two, two coming out. It's going to be a very late 2-2-2. Two, two, two. Hopefully he will be able to keep it alive. He can benefit from its um, superior vision. Especially late game. As Crossroads, they do tend to be a campy map. Uh, giving up laying down that mine. I hear the court mount coming in. There it is. <laughs> More bullets. And the pack did get a shot in. Very nice. And a potential Faust if he goes up here. Ah, uh, no. He's not gonna get it. Or is he? Is he? A little bit of pathing here. Yes, it's a lock. And there comes the 2 2 2. Oh, the 2 2 2. Taking down this. And now. Is he gonna get this? He should. I didn't even dive for that. Dive and dive for that. I mean, getting a uh, quad and a conscript squad for the price of a 2 2 2. Good deal, I'd say. But then again, Clausewitz, he may, may have thought that there would have been a snare gang in there, ready to snare his 2-2-2. Two, two, two. But nice, this was much needed for Clausewitz. Uh, 
needed victory as he is down below 400 ilpen and he's well he has lost a few points but not a lot so an important pickup for Klauswitz. And a little bit unlucky for Ilpern. Uh, driving up against the wall there and having to turn to us. Yeah, getting caught. Just heard a bit of fireworks being lit outside. Oh, 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 where's the grenade? There was supposed to be an earth shattering boom. The enemy is attempting to steal our sector. Oh, oh. Ah, he's out. He's out. <laughs> Misses the mine. Luckily for Clausewitz. Green cover down, more green cover, green cover gaming. What do you need? What do you need? I need guns, lots of guns. And a, a 11, 12 minute support with support armor corps. That's pretty early. Oh. But then again, it is crossroads. You can get some crazy uh, panzer timings on this map. Won't be long before... What's it? Uh, yeah, before Clausewitz needs to get a minesweeper on the field. I am starting to see a few mines here and there. And I see dead people. And one lucky combat engineer. <laughs> one lucky combat engineer. Oh, here's Bigfoot. Bigfoot not stepping on the mine. Lucky for him. Well, it seems like Clausewitz is uh, kicking into high gear now. He's got LMGs going brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
He got mowed down by the red wave. Have no fear, the Panzer IV is here. Do 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 do. Enemy ahead. Congratulations, you hit the haystacks right in front of you. Your aim is impressive. Pack tactical casualties. We ate the horse. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let the pioneers cap that. Grins continuing to push on. Oh, they're clumped up and there's a Panzer IV. That's recipe for disaster. And the Grins, they just keep on pushing the envelope here. Another mine triggered. I think... I think that was the last mine that Elprin had down. At least for now. Oh, wait, what? A Maxim? Okay, I see blood. <laughs> what? I completely missed that. <laughs> One, two, three, where's... Oh, there he is. Rounds incoming. You can say they get around. <laughs> Uh-oh. That flamethrower there could turn him into a spicy chicken. Nope. He's running back. Then again... Adrenaline would make for a bad spice. Oh, there's a mine. Run, run, forest, like there's fire behind you. Bombardment ceased. Grins moving in. No, oh, that's pioneers. Oh, but there are grenadiers with them. It's in range. Very nice. And these men are very, very dead. One, two dead. And this guy, again, he survives. Okay, good. This thing here. Not getting the flamethrower squad. Oh, wait, what's over here? Maxim has been recruited. But the Panzer IV is like nine. This is unsere fuel. You cannot have it. Time to wire this thing off. Once Clawsfitch gets a second to micro that. Could also just destroy the building or even better, don't destroy it and let Elpen walk in there with a squad and then. And no reaction. Oh, we're a reaction and oh, just in time. Just in time. That was looking like a like a wipe and a very forward telemine uh, let's see can Ilprin will Ilprin spot it here comes the aircraft there we go there we go telemine is down it were not spotted and now the the German Siskon pushes off the Maxim all right Good. Klauswitch, he certainly has turned up the heat. He, uh, he had a rough start, but after taking out the M5, things just went in his way. Oh, and yeah, going for a spearhead. And there is one. Oh, it were revealed there. Uh, yes, these men. Arma is the target. Oh, wait. Oh! Special delivery! Ah! Bad angle. Well, I got some of them. He got some of them. Oh, 
the shed. The shed has actually been destroyed. Hmm. Rarely do I see it ever get destroyed, uh, despite the fact that it actually absorbs uh, quite a lot of punishment. But the fragmentation bombing run was just too much. Eyes in the sky as the KV-1 continues to roll in. Get a shot off, get a shot off, get a shot off! Bounce. It looks like it. No, was that really a bounce on the uh, snare? Maybe? Oh, hurry, hurry, hurry. Get that blowtorch burning. Uh, where's the sis? The sis was down here, but it's now being targeted by the other T-34. Ilpern is back with a vengeance. Where's Klauswitz? Oh, he's waiting for Steiner's counterattack. <laughs> and by doing so, he has lost his 280 guns. Well, one was only his, and the other one was stolen. Tiger! Steiner! Steiner's counterattack will save us! Uh, there is a Panzer IV somewhere being repaired. Yes, it's on the other side. It's now coming in to help. And the Tiger is like, Get out of my base. And get out of my face. Sis gun back in Ilpern's hands. And thus, the Tiger is not stepping outside its front door. Or back door in this case. Panzer IV. Let's see that building go down. Ooh. Spooky. Hey, hi, hi, hey, hi, hi. The tiger is in this. What is this hula baloo that we're seeing here? Fragmentation bombing run coming in, but Ilpen is already shifting his men. They're getting a little stuck on the T-34. Oh, Bo did it. That's not a T-34. I know it's KB-1. And goodbye, sis. Oh, what a chaotic engagement here. I love it. Elburn, probably not so much. <gasps> He's going for it. Pioneer down, but... Dead. And suddenly, Elburn is without any tanks, any cis guns. Uh... Woo-hee. However, Clausewitz has no repair pioneers now. And there is no one here to pick up these weapons without having to sacrifice a squad <laughs> sadly all of his friends are free men or less oh. man that could have been a bigger disaster for Ilpern if uh, they were to uh, be stolen and thus Clausewitz is left with uh, the only option of destroying them um, sensible choice man that was <laughs> that was that's what i'm talking about that's why we like company of heroes too watching it for those kinds of engagement that's just mm, so good That's just the Siskon. Anywho, Pioneers! Just gonna get some repairs in. Second Pioneer on the way. Heavy machine gun ready to be picked up. And this hole in the ground is actually a med bunker. Would you believe it? So yeah, the T-34 that did the base inspection here tried to take it out, but... Uh, Steiner's counter-attack. It came through. Save the Clausewitz. Oh, 
How can a hole in the ground be burning? It's just a hole. Alright, tiger. Uh, Alright, the tiger may have taken a huge beating and it hasn't been brought up to its full bearing right now as it tries to exit the base. There we go. <laughs> All right, Klausvich, he, is, he has gotten his breather, caught his air after that uh, last engagement, and he's ready for another round. Ilpern, on the other hand, is like, please don't. I only have, I only have a Siskon. Please wait until I get my SU-85. Mine, or not mine completed. Oh, there it is. There it is, yes. Just a little bit of insurance in case Klausvich comes knocking. Standing in front of green cover is not the way to go, Dimitri. So you called in the SU-85, I'm here, what do I need to do? Where are the other tanks and uh, why are there so many dead bodies and... Uh, oh, is that my dead colleague? Oh, why did you have to call me into this battlefield here? Uh, it's a mess. I will... I am fully focused, completely ignoring my dead comrade. Only positive things will be in my sight. Like enemy armor. Tank destroyer ready. Yes. Nothing backs him for Ilpern. All right. And here I thought he'd go for Siskon, but he must be feeling confident with his one sis and issue 85. That's understandable. More mines. And that thing has not detonated. As you can see. And Ilpern, he's. Yeah. He's stuck in his corner. You don't put baby in the corner. Just don't. And now uh, Klausvitz is like, huh, what is my opponent up to? I'll send in a recon plane. And the open is like, oh yeah? I'm gonna stare right back at you. I'm staring back at you. If eyes could kill, then we probably wouldn't have much of a civilization left. Get that bird out of the sky, man. But this is a free bird. Free bird! I'm free as a bird. And there we go. Finds the SU-85. Not hitting any mines. Ah, but this is sitting way behind. Clever. Clever. Now what? Ilpern, he's just... He's been beaten back into the corner, as previously mentioned. He's trying to save up here, rebuild his forces. <sighs> yeah. And Klausvich, he... Uh, he can bring in one more tank. He could also tech up and get a pants... Oh, he has teched up. Uh, has yet to build the structure, though. I would build the structure to get the uh, passive all-out war. And then go for uh, the Panzerwerfer. Uh, what's this? Oh, hello. Hello. That's a big gun. That is definitely one big gun. Let 
Let's see what the B4 can do for Mother Russia. Huh? Alright, Pioneers. Both of them retreating back to base. I can smell a heavy panzer corpse being built. Ah, sorry, that's just me. Um, but nevertheless, it will be built. And yes, get the heavy panzer corpse fragrance for men. It smells like oil and motor grease. <laughs> oh yeah, Elpern expecting visitors. He knows he's backed into a corner. And uh, when you have your opponent backed into a corner, then it is possible to do the base inspection. And what's this? Munition cache. All right, he wants to get the, the bird flying. There we go, finally. Shut down. It uh, apparently didn't give the B4 any targets. Panther? No, he can't afford it. Well, when I said he can't afford it, I meant it the sense of pop cap. <sighs> boom boom. Nah. Panzerwerfer. Panzerwerfer is a bit squishy and needs to be careful now that the ban the, the Panzer 4, the B4 is on the field. Woo! That thing just flew right over the guy's helmet. Ah, it is going to be a broom boom. The broom boom. I really come to like the room room. I meant the broom boom. Ready for the close-up? <laughs> Slaughterhouse! Oh boy! Fire away! Ha <laughs> ha! Missed! Almost. These men here have perhaps lost their hearing temporarily. <sighs> oh, that's a four. Right in front of a mine. Oh, 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 get the fragmentation bombing run down there. Where? Oh, hello. There it is. Did not destroy it. Still operational. Man, that was close. But Elpern still backed into a corner. Heavy Panzer. Oh, yes. The Broom Bear. He is the equivalent of a French Bulldog. Very ugly, but cute. Here we go. The Broom Boom is coming out. There's a little plane over there. Okay. Sitting behind the shot blocker, it should be able to bomb those Soviets back again and again and again. Just do a little bit of attack ground and then you're in the money, honey. And here we are. Catch this! Tank has opened fire. What's going on over here? Uh-oh. Yep. Oh, bo oh, minesweeper. Nice. That'll make Clausewitz think twice. He may have gotten down one, but there could perhaps be more. Oh, that's a potential snare here, maybe. No? Oh, uh, boom, another mine. Okay, now Clausewitz is definitely not going in there. If there's one, two mines, then there could be a third. <laughs> Who knows how much uh, munitions Elpern has spent. 
Oh, B4 is good to go. As all has been fully repaired. Uh, cannot afford this combo here. Oh, that's a mine. That's another mine. Meanwhile, Tiger's sitting over there. Could be time for this them to go in right now. Yeah, there are a lot of infantry over here that could come in and help out. Even the, um, the Maximus not pointing in that direction. Would be a lot helpful. Uh, but I think Clausewitz is a little bit micro taxed now. There we go. Now, we, now he's moving. And there we go. Flanks the Maxim. One down. That's a grenade. Phew, dodge that. Meanwhile, Panzer IV is in the base being repaired. And this thing still going. Can, can almost afford the combination. The combination. Combination. Good. Very good. And Klosvich, oh man, he's swimming in manpower. That's the thing when you're pop capped. And you just keep on wrecking that manpower in unless you're bleeding. Helpern coming in with another. Fire! Quickly fire! Fire! Well, they got one shot off. Phew. Missed! <laughs> And the mid-bunker has been repaired. The fire has been put out. Oh, hello. Shoot. Again? Ah, uh, lucky. Lucky! How many times has that flamethrower guy escaped? That's at least three times that he managed to escape with a sliver of health. Hmm. Oh, time to go. There we are. Clausewitch. Making another push for the middle ground while also fighting a T-34 over there. When I say fighting, it's more like letting the machine gun take take some shots <laughs> while the tanks sit behind. Good to go once more. Also fully repaired again. Retreat, retreat. Whoopsie doosie, there goes the machine gun. No engine damage on one T-34. Uh, no heavy machine gun here, but he's got plenty of tanks to watch over him. Here's Johnny! Not hitting the mines here. Not hitting them. He is forcing Elpern to react here. And there we go. Mines have been uh, revealed briefly. Oh, Dishka. Hitting one of them. And there we go. For Mother Russia has been activated. And Klauswitz. He's got the Broombear to support. No AT guns though for Klauswitz to back him up here. It is the tanks that are alone against... Well, all of this. <laughs> are we gonna see a ram here to 
Oh, that thing is actually blitzing very slowly. <laughs> and... Oh, lucky Yelpern. Meanwhile... Oh, lots of infantry here. No! Dead. Split second. Too late reaction. From Clausewitz. And boy, oh boy. He's mad. He's angry. Oh, out of control. Okie dokie. Tiger gonna show itself. No! No! Oh, bounce. Lucky. He's blitzing again. Yeah! And here is the cavalry. Yikes! He's too close. He cannot ram this thing. No need to. Boom, boom. That's a lot of infantry out here. Panther on the way. Clawswitch, he's still got so much resources in the bank. I hope he has set their uh, rally point over here so the Panther uh, comes in at this angle here. But no, it comes out over there. And goodbye, Grins. Move! Move, Broombear. Scatter! Do something! Do something! Oh my goodness. Yep, goodbye. See you later, cowboy. Fucking mother! Said the T-34 as it blew up. Famous last word, I suppose. Yeah, Clausewitz infantry there just got a huge knockdown. Any mines here? I do not see. Miss. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Bounce all day. We can bounce all day. The party never stops. Yeah, that's engine damage and that's a ram. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes, yes, yes. Go, Broom Bear. Broom Bear, save us. Save us. SOS, SOS, SOS. Yeah. Come on, get rid of that crew! Save yourself! Oh, how can that survive that? How can that survive that? Broomer goes down! And there's the SU-85. Ah! Oh, what a catastrophe this is turning out to be for Clausewitz. No! No! Huh. Oh. Clausewitz is triple capped. He has no army. He has the resources, but what about his morale? He's still in it. He's reinforcing. He's still in it to win it. Tiger almost, almost good to be called in. So we can get another Tiger, get another Grin. Yeah, maybe even get a Panzergrenadiers out. That could be useful. He can easily get an infantry squad with all this manpower that he has accumulated. So, get some more infantry. Let it either be Panzer Grenadiers to fight around the middle. Or a Grenadier. But then again, he can't afford the LMG on his Grins. Tiger is ready to be called in. And called in it is. And again, how m this wall here has just been such a pain for Clausewitz to deal with. Oh boy, oh boy. Clausewitz, he's down on his luck. Still has plenty of manpower. He wants a new tank. That's what he wants. But still, a little bit of infantry but while we wait for the fuel. 
Yeah, I'm afraid. I'm afraid that Ilpern has got this solid in the bag right now. We have 100 points remaining. 100 points. That's a little more than two minutes for Clausewitz at this rate. But what can you do? What can you do? Steiner has already done his counterattack. Click Panther, maybe? No, it's over. It's over. Clausewitz evaluates the situation and he's like, I give up. His morale got poised by all the, uh, the heavy losses that he took. All right, then. GG's were had. Lots of good engagements, funny engagement. I like it. I love it. Oh, yes. And if you did so, too, hit the like button down there. It's right there. Yes. You clicked it. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Anywho. Uh, hit the dislike button if you, for some reason, thought that this watch uh, some stinky, stinky trash that we just watched. Um, but regardless, consider subscribing if you haven't already done so. All right, then. That's it for this time, you wonderful people. I will see you guys later. Goodbye. But hey, the night is young and the stats are eternal. Let's have a look at them. Uh, Demolisher. Tiger. Not MVP, though. And can we see the uh, efficiency on that thing? All right. All right. Anywho, overview. Elpern doing a lot of damage. Most of it being done to armor, I assume. And otherwise, everything seems to be fine. Captures, lost, yeah. Let me just quickly see this thing here. Yeah, we... Elpern having such a good start and then Clausewitz just dominating mid-late game until the uh, that fateful push that he did. Over here with his uh, Tiger and Panzer IV got caught off guard. Caught off T-34, SU-85, and then everything just blew up. Whoa. Army value? Yeah. Oh man, what a game. What a game. Resource float being floaty. Claw switch. Having so much. But he couldn't seal the deal. So yes, an impressive game, I say. Well played to uh, both players. Sad for Clausewitz that that one fatal mistake over here led to his downfall, though. Anywho, I'll see you wonderful people later. Goodbye.